baby. Hey. Can we go to Italy for some lunch? Italy? Sure. I'm Let's down. Go. Here we are in Italy. In Florida, that is. Epcot. Epcot. Yes, Italy Pavilion. Epcot. Yep. So That's we're here for lunch. Yes. Yep. Uh, we're not here for that long. Just no. this afternoon. We got a flight yeah. coming out later yeah. today. We're here about four hours in here. Yeah, just four yeah. hours here in Epcot. Yeah. So, so uh, what, we can, what we can do. Yeah, there's a cool Italian restaurant in the back. Yeah, and we're gonna eat there today for lunch. What kind of what kind of food are we gonna get? Pizza? Uh, I don't know, pizza, pasta, salad. Maybe we'll see what's on the menu. What kind of pizza? Margarita pizza. Say it again. Margarita pizza. Again. Did I have to say that again? That's great, guys. Yeah. We're back. Woo! So what's cool here at the Italy Italy Pavilion? Italy, baby. Is they have a lot of stores, uh, little, little snacks, food places. Mm -hmm. That's. Um, I guess just like Italy. Yeah, supposedly. I, we yeah, haven't been there yet. Yeah, we haven't been yet. We will, but um, we're taking notes so we can make yeah, a good comparison. Definitely. Yeah, so um, yeah, that's pretty cool, huh? Show you guys around. All right, here's the place we're going to eat called the Napoli Pizza Restaurante. Ate here once before a while ago and it's really good. Got my mug of Moretti lager. I What'd got you get? my house made sangria. Nice. Here we go. Cheers. Salute. Salute. Very good. Good? Good. Good. Alright, we started out with a Caesar salad with some fresh ground black pepper on top. Not bad. It's gonna be a good match with our pizza. Yeah, it's huh? Make it match. Yes. And our pasta. Salad, babe. Very good. Good? Mm. Crispy, right huh? Crispy. Yeah. Mm. Our fresh lasagna just came out. And the fresh basil on top. Man, that looks really good. It's a combination of what? Four uh, ground beef? Four different ground, ground yeah. meats. Yeah. Mm. Right? It's really good. It does. Mm. So. Mm. I'll have to go in for a bite. Oh yeah, the cistella came right out of the oven. Careful, baby. Yeah. That's a good lasagna. It is. It's, it's better than Stouffer's. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, very fresh. The pasta is cooked perfectly. Sauce is not too, not too uh, salty or spicy. It's just perfect. One of the best ones you tasted, baby. It is. Yeah, check that out. Wow. Okay, for our final dish, our 10 inch margarita pizza. Again, with fresh cut basil on top. Looks pretty That's good, awesome, huh, babe? Maybe. This is the last meal right here. Looks good. Here we go. And it's hot. There it goes. That's a big slice, huh? Yeah, it's got it only in the fourth. Wow, it looks really uh, thin crust. Wow. I know. Go, Easy baby. then. She's so excited about the pizza. She dropped her knife. Yes. Beautiful, beautiful. Look at that cheese. Here we go. All my goodies. It's steaming. Oh, look at that char on the bottom. Good char on the bottom. Oh, yeah. Mmm. It's a good 
Good job. How's the stack up against uh, New York City, babe? How about the farrows? Good pizza. The tomato sauce is a bit more mild, but it's really good. Excellent cheese. Mm. Very good. Here we go. Straight up, the Farrells versus Napoli's. Mmm, huh? Like you said, the yeah, tomato sauce is definitely on the mild side, just like it was on a lasagna. But it's super fresh. It was very good. That said, the Farrell. Lunch date. How'd you and like it? It was a very good lunch. It was. It was a very good lunch. Again, that's one of the best lasagnas that we've had. Yes, yes. Yeah. It was very good. Kind of pricey, though. Yeah, it was. Uh, it was about $90 before tip. Yeah, definitely. But um, this is kind of a high-end restaurant at yeah. Disney. So yeah. if you take that into account, that's what it is. We got a pizza, we got a salad, and we got lasagna. Mm -hmm. We also had a sangria and a beer. We did. And it was 90 bucks. Right. Before tip. But um, it was worth it. It was very, very definitely good. Very good. not an everyday thing, but yeah, yeah. definitely worth Ex exactly. it. Exactly. But you know. But there's one thing missing from this lunch. Dessert. Dessert? Let's go see what we're gonna have some dessert. How about in France? In France, baby. I like France. For dessert. For dessert. Yes. You hear that guys? Let's go. Quick stop next door in Germany for some caramel corn. This is yes. where they make it with Werther's. Werther's original, right inside here. Into Kalmel Kush. Picked up some Werther goodies for yep. the plane ride. This is you, they can make this here with Werther's caramel. It is the Werther's popcorn, caramel corn. Some little snacks for the plane. Gotta do it, gotta do it. Right. Well, we didn't plan gotta, on it, but she had to get some, beer, get some beer from Germany. It is. Try it out, babe. It's a grapefruit one yummy. that we usually get. It's good. I can down this right now, just so you know. Prost. Thank you. Very good. It's like 82, 84 degrees yeah, outside humidity. right now. You can see my red cheeks. Yeah. So yeah, cold it's beer is perfect for this perfect. kind of weather. and we're sharing it, so not too tired. Mm -hmm. Okay, we finally made it to France. We're in France, yep. Pavilion. You can tell because there's our little Eiffel Tower. You can sort of kind of see it. Yeah. Somewhere up there. Really small. No small. Yep. Okay. Let's so, go get some dessert. Let's go. All right, I have to say this. Les Halles here. They do have some legit pastries. Very good. My right, baby, your favorite yeah. here is the... Uh, it's the uh, creme brulee. Creme brulee. Okay, let's go ahead. We got the creme brulee and our chocolate uh, croissant, right? Yeah. yeah, we just came back from Paris. So let's yeah. see how it stacks up. Let's see. I know, I know this is going to be good because it's your favorite. This is my favorite. Yeah. And it's still like the best. Even better than the Paris ones. Yeah. Still the best, baby. Pretty consistent? Consistent. Very good. And this is the uh, chocolate croissant that I always seem to get every time. That croissant looks bigger than your head, baby. Uh, It's good. I think French has it on this one though. Not bad. A little dessert wrap up. Yeah. How was your cream brulee? My is excellent. Yeah. How it always is. Very consistent. Yeah, Very good. We couldn't talk too loud inside because there was like people on both sides yeah. of us. But um, my, my croissant was good, but it was something. It felt like it was like mass produced, like yeah. at Costco or something. Definitely. It the, just wasn't like I don't know layers and layers. The chocolate ratio was off a bit. Yeah. There was not that a lot of chocolate. It was very impressive looking though, but I think Paris has the one up on here. Oh, for sure. Yeah. For, for for pastries. The yeah. yeah. Yeah, for sure. Except for that creme brulee, it's amazing. So I'm not sure what we're gonna do now, babe. We we're kind of okay. limited on time now. Uh, yeah. Our lunch date is officially almost over. Yeah. 
So yeah. I think we're just gonna walk around a bit and then head back to the hotel so we can catch our bus. Yep. So we're wrapping it up in Bailey. We'll wrap it up at the airport. We'll see you guys okay. there. Decided to wrap things up here at our hotel. Yeah, we came back at our hotel to catch our shuttle back to the airport, and then we showed up, and now there's a character meet and greet. Yeah, you just you saw she see... had a, a little meet and greet with Captain Hook. Yeah, Captain Hook. And here they are right there. Launch pad is here. Darkwing Duck one. Captain Hook's over there, and Donald is here. Yeah. So, so it's not bad. Yep, that was a fun little vacation, baby. It was. Yeah. Just we were... uh, a quick uh, lunch trip over here, and now mm -hmm. we head back. Now we're heading back. So um. Yeah. We'll catch you on the next one, babe. We will. We will definitely catch you guys on the next one. Thanks for watching.